It's quite a breezy day and I'm realigning the solar panels. Uh, this big tracking panel, I don't use it as a tracker anymore because there's a point where when you've got enough solar panels the summer output is more than you need and of course tracking is only of benefit in the uh, late spring, summer and early autumn. As the arc of the sun goes down then tracking becomes irrelevant. So the sun's just going to be coming round. Anyway, that I've realigned that because that was pushed back for the hay cut uh, and a couple of years ago and it never got pulled forward so I've, I've realigned it so it's virtually south and this other array there goes the wind um, I'm just going to realign that as well so this is a mobile solar array let's just crack on
that's not bad. I think I just need somebody to guide me back just a bit. Needs to go back about, I don't know, a foot, something like that. But it's impossible to see. I got it virtually right, but then we went forward too much. Which is about typical, but it's the right angle. And this big one won't shade that small one. That's a battery one. And as you can see, uh, they're monocrystalline panels. I've had them for quite a long time now. I think they're 240 watts, which shows how old they are. But the sun's coming round, so they'll start generating, so I need to get them wired up. Right, hopefully you found that interesting. Um, mobile units, if you put them on an old trailer chassis, then you can move them. And of course, if you're in an area where uh, planning permission is a problem, then they're mobile, so it's not. So hopefully uh, catch up with you soon, comments and discussion. Cheers for now.